Hello, everybody, and welcome or welcome back to Luck Be a Landlord, the roguelike slot machine drafting game modded, though. Cole first? Sure, why not? We are going to be playing a new mod pack, the Solar System Pack. I guess I'll take the or I don't know. It features 16 new symbols, four new items, all obviously centered around, you know, the Solar System. So, hey, I'm excited to eventually see one. I, you know kind of an issue with modded luck be landlord it's if i want to force a build it it sometimes maybe wouldn't always work though with 16 symbols i bet you we'll be able to come up with something right uh pluto adjacent mice give three more <laughs> okay uh okay i gotcha pluto like the dog understood lightning must be on the bottommost row two times before being destroyed Gives three more for each row this symbol is above. Destroys itself on the bottommost row. Interesting. I mean, I'll take that. So lightning is a new symbol. I don't know what tier it is. Take a key. Why not? But yeah, we got Pluto. We got... Oh, God. I don't really want to take these, but I did take early... I took early coal. I'll take a banana peel then. Fine. Urn, flower, owl. Owl is the only one that's worth slightly more than one, and I'm actually kind of hurting for money here. Hex of Destruction would be okay, I guess. B plus flower is a buff. We do make rent here. Like, it's kind of tight. Lucky Capsule could be a lot of fun. Three whenever you get a multiple of three. Cats give one more. You know what? Let's go coin on a strength. It removes our one coin, but it gives us an amount. Sure. Joke is just, it's just worth three. There's no reason to skip it completely, right? Uh, milk banana. I do have a cat. I guess I'll get the milk for that. Monke. Maybe we should have taken the banana that was not appeal. Wait, what is this? We got candy bar. Destroys adjacent candy bar. Gives six for each. Destroyed. What the heck? Well, we do have one. I'll take the monkey, I suppose. Let's me take, like, coconuts and such while we try and figure out how to freaking live. I'll take the safe for the key. Kind of wanted to not break for a couple turns if we can help it. Uh, present is fine. 102 in a spin. Present is fine with the child. Heart is fine as well. It's not incredible. I'll get the coal. I'll get the coal. But we need to take some pure raw value. Earth. Two value gives one more itself if it's adjacent to at least one human type creature. Adjacent moons give two more. Huh. Interesting. So the owl counts. Good to know. Asteroid Mars. Mars adds candy bar when adjacent to chef. I gotcha. Mars bars. Understood. Um, I don't have a chef, obviously, but it's worth two on its own. It's not bad value. Asteroid destroys itself after being adjacent to all these planets and such. Twice. Adds three meteors, which then also destroy themselves for ten. Okay. All right. Was not adjacent to anything? Really? I, I'm going for the reroll, even though I don't want to. Because of the whole, like, <laughs> early value loss situation. Void creature as well. Okay, we're about to get our first diamond to help us carry on. Uh, I have the banana peel, so I'll grab the thief. We made rent, so it's fine to take him. Neptune. Adjacent water creatures and pearls. Give one more. Oh, an anchor. I'll take it because it's new, but I have I have a pearl, I suppose. Whoa! Okay, we like really made rent. Frozen pizza lets us add twice as many symbols until we get what we need. Destroys stuff if there's at least five you know, planets and such. And then gives 50. I mean, sure. 
Is this a um This is just this is just a raw very rare. I'll I mean, yeah, I'll take that. Of course. Of course I'll take that. Uh so he'll break nothing that I have. I'll remove the cherry. That, okay, that was a lot of chaos. We're down a bunch of stuff now. Neptune. I'll take another Neptune, even though it's not that relevant right now. We could get the turtles so that it is. I'm going to skip to save my bonuses, but good God. The three empties is a bit sketch. Void Fruit's fine. Mercury gives two more if adjacent to at least one meteor, asteroid, or comet or moon. I guess I'll take it. I have ore. I did. I took ore earlier. Do we have a mouse still? We do. We don't need keys. In fact, we like really don't want keys nowadays. Jellyfish for Neptune. For Neptune slash the fact that it's a, an easy remove. Hustling capsule. Yeah, sure. Helps us with the fact that we are currently, like, pretty decently ahead. We got a nice uh, a nice boost there. Beer for the pirates. We got a nice boost there, but I don't think that we're, like, long-term good. Candy bar. I mean, you know, I love the spirit of it, but I'm going to go with the coconut. 500 ores destroyed. I don't know if I want to destroy ore. Twenty-one. We got stuff that'll be removed, yeah? Surely. Surely we do. Fun enough. We could, but I don't really want the banana peel in my deck. Goldfish for the Neptune of it all, but like, honestly, it, it, it gives what? It gives one more. That's not very good. Like, thank God it gives two at a base, otherwise it sucks. I'm going to skip. Arr, arr, arr. Arr, arr, arr. Another candy bar. I mean, candy bar is worth two. We could take it for the, the toddler, I suppose. Toddler gives six. It, does, it doesn't give six X or anything. It just gives the flat six. I'll take the coal. Again, contingency plan sort of bring us into the late game. Scaling, hopefully take a candy that's fine not the best not the worst urn will be not too bad okay so what the hell is going on now get rid of the flower get rid of i guess the cat Need a monkey for a bit still, and then we have a, we have a couple things that are going to be removed here. The spirits will be removed. The coconut got removed already. The candy will be removed. Fifty if every symbol is different. Honestly, honestly, we have that after our asteroids are gone. A very rare. Let me see. Are there? Add sixteen symbols, two commons, nine uncommons, five rares. There's no very rare. So, I could take it, but we already have the pirate that's kind of influencing things a bit. Let's get the uh, the removal. Moon? You know what? I'm going to take it because surely it'll buff something up. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. The luck today. And yet, <laughs> the luck in, a, in the ways that I am not really kind of looking to be... You know, getting lucky. I don't care about getting the pirate. I don't... I guess the re-roll is lucky. The re-roll is very nice. Because then we could... On, um... If there's five rares... That would mean on our rent payments, we could re-roll a hell of a lot. And probably find... Something. There's two essences as well. We already found the one. I'm gonna skip it for now. Or, or, or. We could, we could, we could. We 
Again, just since we're just since we're fine right now, I'll get rid of the bee. Yeah, that is one of the things that buffs there, but the, the earth is getting buffed pretty regularly. Cloud. Oh, fun. Oop, what the heck? Oh, it has a 5% chance of adding rain. 5% chance to transform into a storm cloud. Well, what do I do with the rain? That's cool and all, but I don't know what to do with the rain. Take away the pearl. It, it, the pearl helps with Neptune. Did we, uh, we... We ruined this and we got the diamond! We got the diamond proc right at the wrong time. Protractor, great get. So basically one... Oh, we also have all the, du the double coal, so we weren't going to get it anyways. We weren't going to get it anyways. I'll take this. Hoping we don't get too much rain. Take the big urn. Six from the uh, the spirits is definitely going to beat the hell out of anything else we get. On average. We should probably just get rid of Pluto and the... Oh my god, this is chaotic. Pluto and the mouse... Fun in spirit, but could we do a build with it? Maybe, maybe. Safe for the pirate. I feel like I probably rolled past the safe or something already. Ooh, that was our protractor angle. That's nice. much stuff getting buffed by Neptune. I'm going to take it anyways because I just want the... I want this angle, you know? I want to make sure we're reliably actually using this stuff. Did we get rid of the toddler just now? Of course we did. Ha uh, ha uh, ho. Oh. Lucky carrot, 30 when we get a multiple of three. I'm just gonna do this. Actively don't want lockpick. I saw asteroid. Permanently gives one more when adjacent to the sun. I will. I'm upset. Like, this is so good, but. Oh, God. It's too. It's. I, I hate when I get this lucky on a run. I know it sounds stupid, but I'd rather just get slightly lucky because when I get lucky, people get annoying. <laughs> uh, I'll take puffer fish. It's a good like transitionary thing. Pluto, we got rid of that already. We have so many rerolls. We could probably start using some earlier on. We could probably go like Lucky Capsule into a bunch of rerolls. Pirate takes coin, doesn't he? He does, but then also coin on a string. So let's turn off coin on a string and grab that. There's probably been like a Midas uh, symbol or whatever, but a reminder that I'm not playing uh, for a normal win. I'm playing to use the mod stuff, hopefully. Hopefully. But, like, we do need to get to the post game and see how well we can carry this stuff to that point. Could probably drop Mercury as well. Comet destroys itself after being adjacent to the sun three times. A lot of stuff that's very centered around the sun. Destroys adjacent lightning. And asteroids permanently gives more purr. Ooh, that's interesting, but I feel like we need to, uh, let's find the sun first. Oh, adjacent, all of those gives twice as much. Yeah, I think that's a good call. I think finding the sun first. Let's remove a couple jellyfish and then we'll move, uh, Mercury. Yeah, so sun got, like, a pretty noticeable change for this 
for this update. For this update. For this DLC. <laughs> DLC? You know what I'm saying. I'm losing my mind. Uranus. That's gotta be one of the- yeah, it's one of the ones that's buffed. I'll just- I'll just take it. We got all our diamonds to just kind of help us, uh, pivot. So it's kind of like the flower, except it doesn't get a five times boost. It's kind of nice. We have so many rerolls, we can do something else. Yeah. Force the Lucky Capsule, try and get another um, Venus or Sun. Treasure Chest, obviously, like, technically good. Bop, 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 bop. Nice. Uh... Golem cheese. I mean, like, we could roll like crazy. But I feel like I'm going to save it for, yeah, Lucky Capsule or Rent. And I'm probably not going to really feed this anymore. I do want something to replace the owl, probably. And the, I mean, and the jest at some point here. We could obviously take the flower it, with the suns. If we were just looking to make lots of money, we'd go suns and flowers. Like, suns and flower. You know, that's... I'll take 50 bucks. Moon is not bad, but I want to find something else. Destroys that stuff. Give me... Yeah, give me another Venus. Rain gives one more. They're common and set. Sure. Since we have that element of it. There's the monkey, too. How the hell did the monkey live this long? We need to skip an item for the ramen, but... Well, need to is a strong word. We could skip the that for the ramen. Adjacent moons give two more once per spin. This buffs the earth? It does indeed. Yeah, it's worth it. Buff the earth, then it's worth it. But then, yeah, we just got the diamonds in there as well. Kind of just fixing things up. Asteroid. Whatever. It's just fun to watch. Oh! That wasn't even our protractor spin. This is. <laughs> well, this is going to be pretty good. Yeah. And it kind of like, it scales itself. It's kind of a, it's a nice hands-off, make a build funny. It doesn't scale in like a crazy exponential way. If we can get like telescope and a bunch of suns, obviously it's good. But still, the fact that the suns hit the flower with five X's instead of the two X on the Venus means that Nothing is going to come close to that, like, as far as sun builds go. It was, it's just, like, it's so good that I swear it's a mistake almost every single time. Bap, 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 bap. I don't have a removal. If I had a removal, I'd go for that, but, yeah, I think we've got this off the ground. Bap, bap, bap. And by that, I mean we did it a long time ago. Couple things we still need to change out, remove. I don't, maybe the, is this cloud broken? I don't think I've gotten a single thing from it. Good or otherwise. Jupiter's not a bad call. Okay, fine, I'll take it. <laughs> if you, sure. Okay. I'll get rid of the pumpkin fish too. Please be by Venus. Nope. See, that's the issue. It gets broken by so many things that that's what I was concerned about with the Venus angle. Is it's probably not even gonna be the thing that's by the the asteroid. 
like if we had actual lightning starting to actually show up, it'd be a different story. But the lightning is MIA, as is the rain. It is a 5%, but still, you would think on a 5% after this amount of time we would have found it, like once. And it hasn't transformed. It's never tr added rain. It's never transformed. I'll grab another just to see if it ever happens. Just kind of at a, a science angle. Not that I want the rain, because I have no idea what I would do with it. This is fun. I'll save my rerolls for when we get into the landlord fight to try and get it over quicker. Like, we want to roll a couple times. And then when he's at about half, we want to give it our all. We're spinning about, what? One se okay, 170. 750 is rent. I'm basically I right now I'm just trying to think how to avoid eh, how to avoid getting a dud. Saturn not bad. Venus obviously very good. Cuz we can Throw a bunch of rolls and find, like, maybe a... Oh, wow. You gutted the pirate. Yar! And 457. We'll go one more, and then we'll roll a bunch. Hopefully find, like, a... I don't know, just, like, a buffing capsule or something is basically what I would say. Or something ridiculous. Lucky capsule is not bad, but like. I just don't want a dud. Oh god, screw you, game. I'm not necessarily just looking for a buffing capsule. I'm looking for literally anything useful. I'm so mad. You know what? I was I was never gonna avoid it anyways. And now I have a destru destruction symbol that I can't remove. So we kind of want to add garbage so we're less likely to have it show up. Please don't hit the Venus. Okay. Nice. All right. We should get the uh, the removal tokens we need for the Hex of Destruction. Not really. It doesn't really matter, you know. Comet is interesting. I, like, I like it. We can get the essences. Oh, wait. Stormcloud. Well, I, at this point, I'm like, well, there's another storm cloud. What the heck, man? All right, fine. I'll take the comet. At this point, I'm just mad at that. All right. So what is, uh, yeah, what's the dream here? Just like a whole bunch of Jupiters? I don't know why I'm even rolling here. We're in the post game is why. we Wait, look at that. We finally got rain. It can be done. We finally got the 5%. And a 5% storm cloud. What's going on? Maybe it happened and I missed it earlier. The storm cloud, but... Okay, that produ and it produced lightning. Okay, so when it's at the bottom, it gives basically nothing. And then it... Did it get destroyed? Oh, it got destroyed by Jupiter. There you go. I don't know. I don't... I don't rate it unless there was something that got rid of rain. Like... I don't know. If there's like a soil that was like... Destroys adjacent rain for, like, a little bit of value or something. I don't know. Just something along that angle. Then I would say that the, uh, the cloud... Cloud plus Jupiter angle would be kind of fun.
Oh, this can stack? Oh. There. Now it's just a one-time use, more or less. Comet is fine, but I kind of want to find another sun or something. Sun or Venus. Alright, I'll probably do a couple, like, some off-camera off spinnings. Just for a little bit here. See what we can do. See what we can make happen. I don't know. Obviously, like, the Venus angle is fun, but maybe I'll leave in a couple other planets just for the kicks and wiggles. Alright. Things have changed. Uh, yeah. Got some suns. Got a couple suns here. So we got the telescope essence on here. We're also... Uh, gonna be getting the 2x multiplier for every sun here. We can obviously do better. We could just have one Venus and uh, all these others, but I just wanted to save it for a moment here. See this one spin. How much are we gonna get? How much are we gonna get on one with all of these being adjacent? Yeah. Holy moly. Was that 42 million? Something like that? I think, I think so. Let's turn that off for just a bit. So the average spin right about now without the tele telescope essence, because we don't have actual telescope, is still pretty darn absurd. Pretty, pretty darn absurd. But I just wanted to see what this looked like. I don't know. I wanted to leave the other planets on the board for just a moment uh, before we obviously try the one final permutation, which is the two times multiplier across the board there of the silliness that shall ensue. That's a lot of money. That's a lot of money. So if we got actual telescope instead of just the uh, telescope essence, that'd be incredible. Uh, but hey, it is what it is. I'll be back with the uh, the obvious final permutation, which is just one, one Venus and a bunch of suns. All right, here's the big dumb obvious thing. Uh, so these are all gonna multiply this by two times. Every single one is gonna multiply it by two X. Yep, that's a hell of a lot. That, that is a lot. It's a bunch of money. And yet it reaches nothing close to the freaking flower because that gets a 5x. Either way, I'll be back with guillotine at this point. It's the only logical thing. I'll be right back. Oh my god, finally. I've been looking for this for like 15, 20 minutes. Oh, just mashing. Oh my goodness. Take me away. Look at that, 5,000 on that. Oh, boy. Well, hey, there we go, there we go. That is that, that is that. It's nice, you know, playing a, a mod pack that has less symbols in it, it's more likely to get to that break point. Um, you know? <laughs> hey, made it happen, Captain. Uh, but alas, alas, that is that. That's going to do it here for today. Check out the channel for we'll some more every single day. If you'd be sad to see the series go, you gotta let me know in the form of a comment down below. I'm flipping through a couple mods here at this point. Like, I don't know. I may go back to uh, Daniel's Random Stuff. It's truly a fantastic mod. I'm not sure. I may, you know, see what I can do finding some other ones. There's a lot of really cool ideas for mods and really cool mods out there that are unfortunately, like, crazy broken. There's, like, a really cool Pokemon mod that has crashed, like, pretty much the fifth spin every single time I try it. Uh, so, like, there's a couple things that are just outdated mods or, or broken mods which is a shame because they look really cool and I thought there were so many mods that I could check out but a lot of them are unfortunately completely busted uh, maybe with like a version mis mismatch mismatch or something but alas, alas, that's that. It's going to do it for today. Thank you for watching. Check out the channel for Rogue. Get some more every single day. See you next time. Bye!